Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel, Simply Cinnamon, and if you're new here, welcome into our little world of self-love, self-care, and of course, all things beauty. Today, I am going to be doing like an un-get ready with me because my skincare for nighttime and morning time has changed so much over the last three years of doing my channel. Um, so I figured I would just do an updated version and I just did a review on Vanity Planet. It's like a Clarisonic. Um, it comes with your handheld wand and three different kind of brushes in this container and it has holes in it so that your brushes can dry. So I'm going to just hop right into the video. And the first thing I do when I'm taking off my makeup is because nine times out of 10, I will have false lashes on. And I'm gonna scoot you in and I'm gonna scoot in super close. Um, this is just some micellar water and I have a baby wipe, a makeup, a baby wipe, really. It's not even a makeup wipe, it's just a baby wipe. So what I'll do is I always take off my eye makeup first. So I'll just dip my finger in here and I'll come around my eye. I'm going to flip my, give me one second. I'm going to flip my actual vanity mirror around so I can um, see what I'm doing. And as long as you're gentle, because, um, this doesn't have any oil in it. It's not going to disturb my lash. Just go right up underneath and then I just keep moving the cloth around. I have some liner on. I'm just going to hold my lash down and just go like that. Of course, you just have to be super gentle. Because if you're not, it will yank off the lash and... None of us wants that, right? And what I'll do is if I have a little bit of like a liner, I'll just dip it in here and just go over with a Q-tip. And I even put some, when I was doing my makeup, um, these are, these lashes are a little bit like when I have makeup on, um, they can kind of get lost. They, so I did put a little bit of, um, mascara on, but it was, it was not waterproof. Um, it was just regular mascara. You don't want to, you can put, um, Mascara on your false lash as long as it's not a waterproof mascara because then you'll never be able to get it off So just go back and forth on my lash Hold it down And go again I'll take the other side clean side and go along my lash line And the reason I take my eye makeup off first, again, because I, I will uh, normally have lashes on, is I just want to make sure that, you know, I'm careful around my eye area. And you should always be careful around your eye area anyway, because that skin is so thin. Um, let me take my lipstick off. Okay. All right, so I'm going to pull my hair back. And normally I'd be in my bathroom, but I'm not I'm in my beauty room. So I have a pot of hot water right next to me. I'll try and get a little bit more of this liner off right here. And if for whatever reason I find like, oh, you know, like, the lash seems like it's uh, coming loose in one spot. I'll just gl glue it back down. As long as you're careful, you should be you should be okie dokie. 
All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do, let me lean down, sorry, is I have a clean washcloth here. I'm gonna dip it right into my hot water and have it right next to me. This is Pearl East Blue Lotus 4-in-1 Cleansing Milk. Gently cleanses, um, removes makeup, tones, smooths, um, soap, and sulfate free. So, let's see why it's not coming out. <laughs> because I just got it and I didn't take the thing off. That's why it's not coming out, silly girl. All right. No, oh, literally like that size. And what I'm gonna do is rub it around in my hands, going over my entire face. Down my neck. Okay, so at this point, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it's not soaping up or anything because I'm not like over my sink. So, all right. And as I said in my review, they have three different three different heads. This is like a daily cleanser. This one's a weekly exfoliator. And then they have the silicone one. This one is my absolute favorite disc out of all of them. If you look, see that it's soft, but it's got um, what I feel is a more cleansing kind of a power. So I'm going to take the head and it's waterproof. I'm just dipping it in here. I'm going to take a little bit more of my cleanser, just like a pea size amount, put it right on that head. Let's see if I can do this without making a huge mess. This has two speeds. Now, if, uh, as I said in my other video, if I don't have a full face of makeup on or I'm not exfoliating my skin, I'll use that first brush that I showed you in, in the um, pack. And if you look here, it's very dirty. So I'm submerging it here, turning it on, getting off some of that dirt. And I'm going to go in again. As you can see, it's just get cleaning off the, the head here. So I'm gonna take my clean washcloth. I'm trying to get a good angle, guys. And then I'll remove that makeup. I don't know about anybody else, but my allergies have been like really acting up. And when I film videos, I notice I, I sniff a lot. I'm like, what is that? You know? All right. So dip it back in.
Lash is still hanging on pretty good. Okay, so that's the first step. That's the first step with my skincare at night is getting all the makeup off and getting my face super clean. Now I'm gonna pause the video for one second and I'm gonna get out my derma roller and my serums and I'm gonna show you the second half where I just put it back, put all my skincare back on. So I will be right back in two seconds. Okay, so I'm back. So in this blue basket that I keep in my refrigerator, I have all my nighttime stuff. Um, I derma roll morning and night. And the, you can derma roll der, morning and night as long as you're using a needle, a derma roller needle, needle that is a 0.25. It's specifically made for serums to absorb deeper into your skin. So what I'll do is, um, sorry, what I'll do before I do that, sorry, this is a frozen washcloth, the same one that I use. I just hold it on my face. I do this morning and night. It just helps tighten, tighten your pores back up. It just feels good on the skin, you know. I just, I just feel like it really tightens up my skin, and okay. So then I'll go in with a cotton pad, and I will usually rotate like toners. Uh, this one that I'm using tonight is um, Pixie by Petra. It's a collagen tonic and then tomorrow night i'll use like a glow glow tonic that has um glycolic acid in it that helps with you know turning over dead skin cells and stuff like that so tonight is the collagen um tonic so i'll go on my cotton pad and just go all over my skin and really what you're doing is just you know um Helping the pH levels in your skin after cleansing it. Get them right again. And I mean, the cotton pad's got a little bit of residue left on it, but not a whole lot. That, um, I really love that Vanity Planet, the handheld, um, facial cleanser. Okay, so now I will take my two, my one, one my point two five derma roller, and I am gonna just go over. I'm looking in my regular mirror too, right here. I'm going over my skin. Now the correct way is ten times this way, ten times this way, ten times this way, ten times that way. That's the correct way to do it. But I'm myself. On me and I'm gonna you know I do do it in that fashion but I really don't lift up the derma roller I just keep going back and forth in different directions on my forehead now these are just micro needles and basically what I'm doing is I mean as like I said it's a two five See, so you can barely see those needles there. But they're there. And all it's doing is making little tiny micro punctures in my skin so that the serums that I put on 99% deeper absorption rate. No, under my chin. And I've been really working on like my neck area here. Because I've been having like, you know, the sagging under here.
Now, like I said, I, I'm going to be doing a, let me see if I close this, if I get rid of some of this glare. There we go. Um, I'm going to be doing an updated, <clears throat> an updated morning routine as well. Go down the bridge of my nose. I'll go under my eye, but I won't put a lot of pressure there. I mean, I'm barely on the skin. And I do use, um, they say up to four serums. I do five. I'm a little extra, I know. So every, every serum that I use, um, I only use a, like one pump. So this is a vitamin C serum, one pump in my hand. I actually just mix them all together one pump this is a retinol 2.5 this one is advanced hyaluronic acid serum whoops it went sideways it went on me <laughs> all right whatever this one is an overnight glow serum from pixie by petra i don't have it in a pump i just a dot of that and then this is called awake glow pill it's a glow serum. Score that. It looks like a lot. It's really not. And I will just push it into the skin. Unzip and go down a little bit on my decollete area. My chest. Because I'm using it I put it on my hands, up my arms. So because I, you know, there they are five serums. So, you know, it's okay. I spread it everywhere. Then I take, I just got this in the mail. It's a rose quartz roller. It's, you can get it in jade. This is from Grace and Stella. Um... What I'm doing is, I, you saw me push that into my skin. So now I'm going over with my rose quartz um, roller. And I am pushing it that much further into my skin. All of those serums. And I keep this in the fridge along with all of my skincare. It's nice and cold. It feels awesome on the skin. So instead of using my hands to keep rubbing it in, which you can actually cause micro um, exfoliation from that, if you keep rubbing and rubbing and rubbing your skin, this is smooth. So it literally is just pushing it in with the coldness of the rose quartz. And it's also sealing my pores as I'm doing it. So all of those serums are just getting locked right into my skin. Now I'll go to the little end and I'll just come right under my orbital bone here, pushing those serums under my eye. Okay. And then I will go in with an eye cream. This I kind of, this I made this concoction up myself. It has coconut oil. It has coffee. Um, it has coffee extract in it, and it has some aloe in it. And I'll put it under my skin here. Using, I use coffee. The when I say coffee extract, what I mean is I'll take, I have a Keurig, so I'll take my coffee grounds and open up the little Keurig pack and I literally will take five or six of them and leave them sit in warm, warm water 
that's been filtered. I'll heat it up. I'll leave it sit in there. And I will put it through a strainer. And then whatever's through that is I'll put like a, a cloth on top of the strainer and go through it again. And it, it literally is like coffee that has been like, it's like five times the strength. It's almost like espresso. So I put that on. Then I'll go in with um, my Age Perfect Eye Renewal from L'Oreal. I love this. I've been using this for years. Um, I use this just at night because I found a new one, an, um, something new and different for during the day. So when I do my skincare during the day, I will um, show you guys which what I'm using for during the day. I've been, like I said, I've been using the Age Renewal um, for years now, and I love it. Okay, so again, because I am always making up my own concoctions and my own, this is a face cream that I made, and I'm going to probably do a video on it soon. It is um, made from rice, and it has all kinds of good stuff in it. So put that cream all over my face. It's made from rice. It's got, again, coffee extract in it. It's got vitamin E, um, vitamin E oil in it. I'm just pushing that into my skin. A little bit more. And that's it. That is my nighttime skincare routine. Um, that's all that I do. And um, I've been, if you're diligent with your skincare and you, you know, make sure that you take care of your skin morning and night, your skin will take care of you. You'll have a better canvas to work with. You'll notice like, hey, I don't need as much makeup as I used to, as I used to. Because your skin is naturally glowy and pretty just from taking care of it. So that's it. That is how I take off my makeup. That's how I put my skincare on at night. So thank you all for tuning in. I'm sending you light. I'm sending you love. Be blessed. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Take care of each other. I'll see you all again soon in my next video. Bye.